Both sides suffered opening day defeats ahead of this Munster derby as the Blues went in search of the first Premier Division win in Cork since 2004. And it was Waterford who created the first real chance. Zach Albuzetti was forced wide after initially picking up the ball outside the city area. He delivered the cross, come shot, and it landed on the roof of Mark McNulty's net. A goal kick by Matt Connor was helped on by Ishmael Akinadi and by Elbuzadi, and it almost led to the opening goal. Bastian Eri squared it unselfishly for Scott Twine, but he couldn't supply the finish as McNulty saved from the unknown Swindon striker. Kenny Brown, the former City player, didn't make the best of clearances under the dropping ball. It gave City their best opportunity over the opening half. Carl Shepard's effort was blocked. James Tilly picked up the loose ball. Kevin O'Connor was waiting inside the area, only to see his shot blocked by the legs of Connor. Blues eventually getting the ball clear. But right on the stroke of half-time, Waterford hit the front and it was all due to the brilliance of the Frenchman, Bastian Erie. What about this for a finish from the edge of the area? And Waterford took a 1-0 lead to the break as Erie celebrated in front of the shed. The last time Waterford beat Cork at Turner's Cross was actually in 2011 when both were in the first division. And they almost got a second when Erie fed Shane Duggan who in turn picked out Twine, but a shot missed its target. John Caulfield then sprung new signing Liam Nash from his bench, and he went mighty close to equalising for City. Substitute Gary Comerford, a former Blues man with a cross. Carl Shepard with the shot, which was kicked away from close to the line. O'Connor headed it back into the area, and Nash just missed with the overhead kick. Cork kept up the pressure, trying to get the equalising goal. Conor McCarthy with a cross, but it was headed clear, and the Blues broke. With City now at sixes and sevens, Twine picked up the ball in midfield, played it to Erie, who in turn picked up the run of El Buzetti, and in the 90th minute, El Buzetti ensured that the Blues would take all three points. Celebrating in front of the away supporters, they finished Cork City nil, Waterford two.